to you about what I got in my August Ipsy. I'm wearing a lipstick I received. I'm wearing the eyeshadow I received. So let me just go ahead and show you what I received um, for August. This is the one thing I have not tried yet. It is the Michael Todd Jojoba Charcoal Facial Scrub. I am working on a facial scrub currently from Lush that I love. Um, but I will try this one as soon as I run out or if I feel like mixing it up and I'll let you know how I liked it. Um, I currently have a post on my blog about my Ipsy, so if you want to see everything in detail, you want to see pictures, uh, swatches, that kind of thing, it's in there. Um, this I also received is the Mika Beauty uh, Cosmetics Shimmer Powder Number 17 Bronze. And it is a loose powder, but um, there is a sifter. There's three little holes so that you can uh, tap product out into your lid, which is perfect. And I use that today in my inner crease. I'll insert a clip of me uh, putting it on so you can see. How it wears, I put it on over the top of Urban Decay Sin uh, shadow pencil uh, for a sticky base. So I put this down first and then I put this down uh, my whole inner corner and I swept it up and it met the uh, the other color. So I really liked how it applied actually. I'm very excited about that. I usually don't um, get a lot of shimmers um, that are loose, but I really like this one a lot. It's very pigmented, very iridescent. So if you're into really shiny looks, you're gonna love it. Uh, I also received Lash Booster Mascara by Pixi. I received it in Blackest Black, I believe is what it's called. Um, Black is black, yes. I have not opened it yet because I have a lot of open mascaras right now and I need to finish some of them up before I let... Because, you know, once you open a mascara, the air gets in there and it starts kind of... The, the clock starts ticking, so you have to use it within a couple months um, or else you have to chuck it because it dries out. So it's uh, saran wrapped. It's like wrapped very tightly, so that's really nice. Um, they thought that through. I received also... An eye, uh, eyebrow pencil by Chella. Chella. This brand uh, is new to me, but I believe Ipsy has been adding it to their bags for a while. If you've been following my blog for a while, you know I used to do a Birchbox versus Ipsy kind of like Smackdown thing, and then I kind of went, ugh, I don't want to do the beauty subscriptions anymore. I have too much stuff to try. And so I actually discontinued my Birchbox and my Ipsy. I, I uh, disenrolled from both, and then I really missed my Ipsy. So while I was gone, I believe that they uh, gave out a jumbo highlight pencil from Chella for under your brows, inner corners, whatnot. So maybe I'll try that too, because this Chella eyebrow pencil I love. It's super thin. This is so tiny so tiny and the uh, point is very very thin as well and uh, and it's the perfect match for me because I took my quiz and so they knew what my hair color was so this is like the perfect match for me I really love this I'm actually uh, wearing it today as well and then last but not least Urban Decay came out with um, some revolution lipsticks is what they're called and uh, it's kind of, it's not brand new. It's probably a couple of months old already that they came out with this Revolution uh, lipstick. I received the color Anarchy. And uh, so they give you like a chart, which is really helpful with all the colors that they have. And they tell you down here what it is that you received. They give you a little explanation on the lipstick. Um, it talks about pigmentation, creamy shine, nourishing oils. Uh, it is a higher end lipstick, obviously. Urban Decay is higher end, so it's going to be a little on the pricey side. I believe they run $18, $19 at Sephora for a full size two. Uh, and they also came out with lip pencils from the Revolution uh, line, so they have a lot of different choices there. So I mean, let me show you guys what came inside. It's the tiniest, cutest little lipstick I've ever seen. It says it's stamped UD on the top cap, 
and on the bottom it has the name Anarchy with the color. So the actual tag is the same color of the lipstick and I am wearing it today. And let me open it up for you. It is so adorable. It's really cute. It's tiny, it's perfect for your purse. This is a great way to t uh, try a new product before you commit to buying the full size or before you commit to buying more colors. Um, from what I hear, the consistency is the same on all the colors, um, which is my favorite kind of consistency. It's creamy, pigmented, no shimmer, no glitter, um, nothing but just a really nice cream lipstick. So I actually am loving this and I'd like to try more colors. I'll insert a clip of how it applies. It applies really smooth, really lovely. I put no lip liner, I put no base, there's nothing under this and it was like, it's a one swipe type of deal. So I love that. Uh, good lipstick there. And um, so the bag looks like this this month. It says Ipsy on it. It says Glamour Academy. Not this month. This is for August. I'm backed up a month. Sorry. Um, it says Glamour Academy. So it was like the prep, the back to school prep. So it was really cute. The packaging was really cute. Uh, so that's pretty much everything I got in my Ipsy. If you, like I said, want to see close-ups, uh, swatches they're on my blog right now so I'll link uh, link to my blog for that um, if you are not aware of what Ipsy is it's I uh, didn't say anything it's a $10 monthly subscription so it's only $10 a month very reasonable you get I've noticed you get at least one full-size product this time the eyeshadow was full-size um, but I've received more than one before and I've received bags that are priced if you were to buy everything individually at like 80 plus dollars. So you're spending 10 for something that costs a lot more. It's a great way to try new brands, uh, new makeup. Uh, if you didn't like it, then give it to a friend and you didn't buy it. You know, you essentially uh, paid beans for it. So everything is super, super cheap uh, when you do it like this. And then, you know, like with the Urban Decay lipsticks, they're more expensive. So how great is it that I was able to try the formula before I decided if I wanted to buy a full size um, and then what colors I wanted to pick I think that's fantastic because now I know that I really like them so they're worth the you know they're under 20 but they're worth that so anyway I hope you guys enjoyed um, I will leave a link down below so that you can uh, click a link and go straight to Ipsy um, and kind of take a look and see around the site it's really fun it's very very fun and uh, so have a great day bye